Welcome to Joe Runesrilla. I'm Joe Cressera, America's service sales coach. And I'm going to expose the truth behind the fake news with AI call monitoring technology for home service professionals. Watch this episode to discover if doomsday is just around the corner for service and salespeople in the home service industry. One of my greatest fears when I first heard Rilla scream, the end of ride-alongs, was how can I support a technology that's gonna put millions of service and salespeople out of business? Every time a new tool or technology emerges, the greatest fear is that it'll wipe out industries overnight. So then I started digging into the facts to see if I could ruin Rilla before it ever got started and devastated humanity. So I started researching other automated technologies to see how they affected the average person and what I found stunned me. In 1901, there were over 21 million horses, but only 4,000 automobiles in the United States. By 1915, the carriage industry had been devastated by the automobile industry. Everyone was concerned that blacksmiths and horse stables would be wiped out. But within a few short years, those jobs taken from blacksmiths turned into millions of jobs for the auto mechanics, assembly line workers, marketers, car salespeople, and executives. The auto industry boomed and created massive opportunity for everybody who makes or uses a car or truck. As soon as people learned how to steal music and videos from the internet, entertainment executives had a meltdown. Now you can't attribute the entertainment industry's decline to just things like Napster, LimeWire, or Pirate Bay alone. But the popularity of these file sharing services in the early 2000s made profits drop across the entire industry. Court orders and lawsuits followed suit and Napster finally went down, but the ball was already in play. Streaming and file sharing kept on keeping on, and the bigwigs never stopped sweating, and the people never stopped sharing files instead of purchasing direct from the source. RIP movies and TV weren't far behind, with new technologies and digital cameras killing Blockbuster and Kodak. Finally, monetization fell from heaven. And before you know it, the big dogs could eat again. This once pirated industry gave birth to an entirely different way of doing business, which has created millions of new jobs and a multitude of different opportunities across several sub-industries. Now the music industry has returned to its 20 plus billion dollar annual revenue generator and has now surpassed where it was 30 years ago. The film industry has done the same. Not to mention all the social media influencers that are now making billions of dollars streaming their songs and making their videos, hosting podcasts, or just reacting to others who have done the same. All of this has been created through a once terrifying automated technology. So, did Joe ruin Rilla? Um, no. In fact, I've done a 180 on this. After putting a lot of thought into it, Rilla wins this round. Mark my words, AI will assist and grow service teams by creating more jobs, and it will not replace service professionals or make us obsolete. I found that Rilla can transcribe calls, provide real-time feedback, and suggest improvements before your next call, making the job easier and less stressful, but more importantly, increasing the quality of your work, which will grow and scale your company. There'll be way more installers, service people, call-by-call -call managers, and the entire team will grow. AI solutions like Rilla will enhance and grow our teams by handling routine tasks that used to be impossible, like Rilla doing remote ride-alongs at lightning speed. This allows service pros to focus on what they do best, building relationships and doing the work for clients and providing excellent customer service making the job easier and less stressful, but more importantly, increasing the quality of your work, which will grow and scale your company. But don't worry, I haven't given up trying to ruin Rilla, so stay tuned for the next episode.